Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to episode 24 of Being a Dick. I hope you guys are ready. Let's go ahead and jump into the video. Morning time, we're at Sage's uh, place still. Let's uh, find out what's going to happen today. Yesterday was a complete bust. Morning. Hey, good morning. What time is it? It's 6 a.m. Oh, she gets up early. Seriously? Are you always this early? I had some hot business to plan for, and I woke up an hour ago restless. I couldn't sleep well. Oh, sorry if I ruined your beauty sleep. <laughs> Don't worry, it's not because of you. I have a lot on my plate lately. Being a president must mean a lot of work. Yeah, it is, especially when it comes to the ceremony. You know, collecting fees from sisters, finding ways to earn money for the hots. I'm so freaking thankful to have Quinn to help me out. Quinn? How is she helping you out? She's amazing, really. I don't even have to ask her for most of the things. She just knows what needs to be done, and then she does it. Nice to have someone to help you run things, I guess. It's kind of like what Tommy is to Rusty. Yeah, definitely. That's what that's what a vice president should be like. Not like, duh. Well, his family Jim's been sponsoring the tri office for years, but other than that, he leaves everything to Chad. Well, left everything to Chad, I guess. I didn't realize that you and Quinn were close. I'm close with all the sisters, but for Quinn... What can I say? She was my daughter, and she grew on me. Besides, after next year, the Hots need someone to fill my shoes. Oh, shoot, you're quitting? <laughs> it's called graduating, and yes, I'm graduating next year. Oh, I see. Now, what are we going to do about you? Uh, what do you mean? Having a dude staying in a sorority, that's breaking all kinds of rules. You can't do anything about that? Uh, I like you. And I know the feeling of looking for a place to belong. Stay with me until you get your shit sorted. But get it sorted fast so us girls don't get into trouble. Oh, well, thank you so much. I'll find a way to repay you. You teach me how to play guitar, and we'll call it even. Sound good? Hmm, yeah, absolutely. Hey, join me for breakfast. Okay, all right. Say, you're a freshman. Would you happen to know two students named Ashley and Lily? Uh, I really stink with names. Ashley, Ashley. Ashley. One of them had short hair, red hair, right? Oh, short girl, reddish hair? Yeah, that's her. And Lily, um... Uh... Pink Rose? The dicks know her. The dicks do know her. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, um... She's a dick recommendation, right? I'm impressed. You're not so clueless. Are they new hots? They might be, but I'll leave that decision to Quinn. You know, to test her with these, you know, to test her with these sorts of tasks. Speaking of Quinn, she mentioned you. Oh, she did, huh? Yeah. Do you like her or something? <laughs> How do you mean? That's what I want to know. How do you mean? Actually, I, I don't. If I'm being honest, I know Jonathan doesn't like her at all. So I'm going to say no. No, I really don't like Quinn. Interesting. Why? I think she likes you. Really? <laughs> Quinn? <laughs> no way. She didn't say it, but you pick up on the little things, you know? She generally doesn't talk about guys that much, but... F me, she's been ranting a lot about you. I figured that you either got under her skin or that she likes you. Alright, it's probably the first one. I, I, I think so, too. It's probably the first one. It could be. Although, no one really gets under her skin. 
Hmm. But, eh, forget it. Oh, tell me, tell me, what are you gonna say? What are you gonna say? She seems to think that you're trying to ruin her fun, but the way she says it, it's kind of like a cat chasing a mouse. Half of it's play and the other half is serious. What I'm trying to say is, catch her up if you're interested. But yeah, I'll think about it. About me staying here, what will you tell the others? In my experience, it's better to be upfront with all the sisters. Rumors aren't good for anyone, and I'm not going to let them think I'm trying to hide you from them. Jonathan, who are you doing here? Uh, no one. Should I say you interested? <laughs> uh, no. Uh, let, let's see what she says if I say you interested. Maybe you. Are you interested? Fat chance, but I'll tell John Boy that you asked that. Who's John Boy? Jonathan is just trying to be funny. It's nothing like that. Nothing like what? Morning sisters in someone's one night stand. Where the F is Arieth? Don't get any ideas. Jonathan is going to stay with me for a while. He's here because he had some roommate trouble. Roommate trouble? Again? Was it Troy this time too? No, no, it was Maya. And that's what I hear. Haha. <laughs> A lover spat between Kendall and Barbie. Ah, uh, that joke's getting old. Very funny, Quinn. That's getting old, don't you think? What, which part of it? Me insinuating that you two are dolls that I can play with or that Maya looks like a bimbo? Hmm. Recite the hot code. What is the hot code? I'm going to recite it just because I don't know it. Let's see, that doesn't sound like don't turn on each other to me. Cute, but that code is reserved for real sisters. Oh, okay. All right. Speaking of Maya, I have some mother-daughter time on my schedule. Okay. Um, need to talk after that. Dodd dropped by and it's not good. Oh no. Come on. Don't forget about Lily and Ashley. I got it. Okay. So, Sage, what's this rumor about Chad getting kicked out of the jocks? Is it true? Yeah, I saw it on Rooster. We'll see. So, it's not true? He made some stupid decisions lately. I'm looking into it. It doesn't look very good. Your buddies will be happy to hear that, huh? Hey, whoa, whoa, leave me out of this. Okay, all right, just leave me out. I find it very interesting that they say it was your fault. Impressive how you managed to beat him up and get him in trouble for it. Melanie, be nice to our guest. It's just a rumor, of course. Oh, stop getting your news from rumors. Okay? Alright, I need to go find Mona. Talk to you later. Hey, uh, can I use a shower? Feel like home. Sisters, be nice to him. Okay, am I gonna use a shower? I remember this place. Yeah, we all we all remember this place, Jonathan. Yep, exactly. You uh you did one of your first tasks here and you got caught. Call out, don't call out. I should call out. Hey, there's no one in here, right? Okay, I'm good. Oh, well, these showers are tiny. But a lot cleaner than the co-ed showers, that's for sure. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Hold on. Oh. Warn them. I'm gonna warn them. I don't want another situation. I'm tired of being called purrs. Ladies and gentlemen, they, uh, they got really hot and steamy at the end there. I'm sorry that I'm gonna have to cut it and not let you watch it, but you know, it is what it is. You can thank YouTube's policies for that. But uh, let me uh, let me see if I can sum it up for you. Um, 
Things happened. That's it. That's all I can tell you. Things happened. Two girls. One shower. And one dude. That's all you need to know. That's all you need to know. Anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you uh, liked the video. If you did, make sure you smack that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.